All right, guys. So you want to know how you get that Yagi over here? How do you get this Yagi to work with your PS3, right? Well, as you can see, the Yagi is hooked up. I got a big, long extension cord, a long, long, long extension cord or a USB cord hooked up to the front of my PC. This is the Yagi antenna, right? You can see we are hooked on. You can see it right there. There it is there. We are hooked on. Okay. So how do you make this work with the Yagi? Okay. There is no way you can rebroadcast the signal. But you can use your PC. You can use your PC. You know, you see how I got the blue cord hooked up right there in my Ethernet port? You hook up the the cord right there and you hook that up to the back of your the PlayStation as you can see okay you gotta do that first once you got that hooked up you go back over here to over here where it says connected right you're gonna open where it says open up network that's what you're gonna open then you're gonna click on this right now you're gonna go on properties and you're gonna go to sharing make sure these two are checked off okay and then you're gonna put okay and there you go okay now I'm gonna turn on my PlayStation okay I'll show you guys how easy it is okay it's not that hard And as you can see, we are logged into PlayStation Network. It's gonna start, we'll say sign in here in a little bit. We are logged in. You see all the stuff right here, PlayStation Network and all that bullshit. Okay? So, and on your PC, it should look something like this. On your PC, it should look like this. It should look something like that. See, you got your regular, the Yagi regular, and then you got this right here. That's your PlayStation 3. Okay, I hope that tutorial has been informative for anybody who's been asking me questions on, on Amazon about the, the Yagi. It is possible to get the Yagi antenna to give your PS3 internet if you know how to do it. Alright? Peace.